Welcome back to Goodnight Lighthouse. I'm Miss Dorothy, and I'm here to read you another story. And I've got one of your favorites tonight. Aubrey Pendergraft brought us another Piggy and Elephant book. She just loves Piggy and Elephant books. And she brought us one of her favorites tonight that I think you're going to like too. This book is called, Are You Ready to Play Outside? Are You Ready to Play Outside? Piggy and Elephant are ready to play outside. Are you ready to play outside? I know I am. Weather's been beautiful lately, and it just makes us want to play outside. We need to see what happens when Piggy and Elephant decide that they want to play outside. We need to get into this book. Are you ready to get into this book with Miss Dorothy and find out why it's one of Aubrey's favorites? Good. I need you to sit up and listen up, because here we go. Piggy! says Elephant. Carol! says Piggy as they run towards each other. Are you ready to play outside? says Cheryl. Yes, yes, yes! squeals Piggy, who's very excited. We are going to do everything today, says Piggy. We are going to run. We are going to skip. We are going to jump. Nothing can stop us, hollers Piggy. Plink. Uh-oh, what just fell on Piggy's head? Oh, no, says Piggy. It is starting to rain. It is raining. Cries Piggy. It is pouring. Cries Piggy, who looks so unhappy. It is really pouring. I have never seen so much rain in my life, says Piggy. I do not like rain, hollers Piggy. Poor Gerald. I am not a happy pig, proclaims Piggy. And you can tell by her face, she is not a happy pig. Hmm. Huh. Just not happy. But all of a sudden, she's not getting wet. What happened? Look what Gerald's doing. Thank you, Gerald, says Piggy, because Gerald is keeping him dry, keeping Piggy dry with his ear. But it is still raining. Grr. Piggy is dry, but she's still not happy. How can anyone play outside with all this rain? Hollers Piggy. says the worm. Yay! says the other worm coming out of the ground. Splish, splish, splash, splash, splish, splish, splash, splash. The worms are having fun in the rain. Hmm. Gerald and Piggy look confused. They are having fun, says Gerald. Maybe we can have fun too. We can try, says Piggy. Splash! Piggy jumps in a puddle. This is great! Let's play! Shouts Piggy. Run, run, run! Skip, skip, skip! Jump, jump, jump! I love rain, says Piggy who's having a lot of fun now in the rain. I hope it rains all day. Uh-oh, what's happening? Rats, says Piggy. Now I like rain, and now the rain has stopped, 
says Piggy. I am not a happy pig. Do not worry, Piggy. I have a plan, says Gerald. Rain, says Piggy, who's all happy because suddenly it's raining again. <gasps> it's raining because Gerald is spouting water all over Piggy. Elephants make the best friends, says wow. Piggy. Wow, what a crazy book. I see now why Aubrey likes it so much. Piggy and Elephant can have fun no matter what. First, they wanted to play outside, and it was beautiful and sunny, and they were happy. And then it started to rain, and they started to complain. But then they learned how to have fun in the rain, and then it stopped raining, but then Elephant made it rain some more so that they could have fun playing outside. I think it's a good thing when you have an elephant for a friend because then you can have fun no matter what's happening. Piggy and Elephant just make me happy. I love how much fun they have together and I love that they went to play outside. We should probably go play outside. Maybe tomorrow. That would be a fun thing to do. Thank you, Aubrey, for bringing this book in. I know my friends really liked it. I really liked it. I need people to bring me more books. Aubrey's bringing me book, books, and that's great. But I need other people to bring me books. Miss Darcy's running out of ideas. What is your favorite book? Can you tell me? Can you write me a note and let me know what your favorite book is? And then I'll go find it and I will read it to you and call out your name just like I called out Aubrey's name. And then be sure you subscribe to the channel so you'll know exactly when Miss Dorothy is here reading your book. This has been a lot of fun. I'm so thankful that Aubrey brought that book. I'm so thankful that we had this time together. But now it's not time to go play outside, is it? No, it's time to go to bed. We need to get all rested up so we can play outside tomorrow. If it rains, if it's sunny, whatever, we're going to make a good day out of it. And before you go to sleep, I'd like to pray with you about having a great day tomorrow. Would you do that? Would you pray with Miss Dorothy? Great. Fold your hands and close your eyes. Here we go. Dear God, thank you for all the fun that we had today. Thank you for all the time we had to play together inside and outside, the time with our friends, the time with our families. Now, Lord, please give us a good night's sleep. Watch over everybody that I love. Keep them safe and cozy through the night so that we can get together tomorrow and play some more and have some more fun. Thank you for all you do for us. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, little piggy. Time for you to get off to bed. Miss Dorothy's got to get to bed because I want to wake up early and go out and play. And I hope that you will too. You be sure to come back and see me real soon. I'm going to be sitting right here waiting to read to you. And I can't wait to see you again. Bye.